Hey everybody, it's Everett back with you from Hood Time Welding. Today we have two small jobs. First one is this uh, pipe. It's uh, what? Sorry, <laughs> what it's for is a windmill. Uh, I guess there's something that gets mounted on top, so we're gonna have to weld this flange on. Um, pretty easy job there. The big thing about it is we'll have to cut the pipe straight here. It's uh, it might be hard for you to see, but it's awful crooked. Cut that straight, clean it up. Uh, the, the flange is stainless, but it's 400 series. Doesn't matter. We're gonna uh, use a 309 rod for it because it's stainless to mild steel and the only thing I have to do it with is TIG so we'll be TIG welding that on. Like I said it's a small flange it's gonna be a pretty easy thing to do. The big thing about it is once I get it on here you know I'll put a tack here and just make sure it's uh, square with the pipe once we get everything tacked together. So pretty easy thing to do with that. And then we'll move on to the second one, and I'll explain that one when we get started. So let's go ahead and get started on this one and see how we do. So we got this all welded on. You can see I welded the inside and then welded the outside. Um, it wasn't acting like regular stainless. I don't know if it's just a crappy stainless. I don't know what it is, but having a little bit of a struggle with it, but I did get it. Did a nice weld. So the next project is an old familiar. We have another lawnmower tech. So let me go ahead and show you this one. So this one, it's a pretty simple repair. We've got to fix this hole right here. And then uh, this bracket actually broke right off right there. Uh, the customer already has it cleaned up pretty much for me. But I'm going to bevel where it's touching. Sorry, trying to get a view there. And then I'm going to actually run a small plate up inside to give it some more reinforcement. So we'll go ahead and get started on that one.
So there you go. This one's all done too. This stuff's getting thin. Um, I don't think he's going to have much longer just because it's getting thin. And you can see I put that extra plate in here to try to stiffen that up um, so that that doesn't happen again. You know, welded that all back together. Sort of hard to see. Oh, some of the paint got on here from when I was grinding. But we got that welded. And I just threw an extra weld in here. Because, you know, I always say they never weld enough of it. But um, I did put this plate in because that's what goes in the middle just to make sure the distance stayed the same and that it would still work on his tractor. But as always, I hope you like my content. Big thumbs up. It's always nice. But I know it's just another, the second job here was just another lawnmower deck, but they need attention too. And um, hope you enjoyed the video. We'll talk to you later. Bye.